All right, happening today, the two day long Made in America Music Festival. It's wrapping up, and with large crowds expected to turn out for the event's finale, officials are working to maintain safety for all attendees. I witnessed news reporter Wakisha Bailey is live there on the parkway. We got some concert goers there now, but Wakisha, is Bad Bunny there yet? <laughs> Good morning, Howard. You know what? I can't believe at this hour that there are already tons of people arriving, walking around. We're seeing also a lot of the workers that also work here at this festival arrive in this 8 o'clock hour. Now, as you mentioned, security is really a high priority for a lot of these festival goers and the city as well. Now, Saturday, Eyewitness News was at the Made in America Festival where thousands of people packed the Ben Franklin Park Way. Many dancing to their favorite artists performing on three stages. This is the first major festival along the parkway since the 4th of July shooting. Now, unlike the 4th of July, this festival is a ticketed and closed in event. It starts with a security checkpoint where tickets are scanned and everyone must go through metal detectors. Very excited to come see my family and my friends and be able to see a lot of different artists. I feel super safe here. There's so many cops making sure all of us are good and safe. There's a lot of gates you have to go through in order to get in here. Different, like, security measurement. And as we've been mentioning all morning, Howard, we're starting to see these festival goers come out, beat the traffic. But one thing that we want to remind everyone is that there is a bag policy in place, which means that all bags will be searched. Reporting from Ben Franklin Parkway, Wakisha Bailey, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right. Thank you, Wakisha.